welcome back and thanks so much for joining us. Carolina Country Music Fest is one week away and if you're looking for a ticket to this year's sold out event, unfortunately it's easy to fall for fake ticket scams or overpay. So of course it pays to do your homework. Joining us now is Nicole Cordero from the BBB with some tips to keep in mind when buying from ticket resellers. Nicole, thanks so much for being here. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. So obviously CCMF, not only is it sold out, but it's sold out really fast. So what are the risks for those maybe wanting to try and find some last minute tickets? Yes, so a lot of people want to go and find resale tickets, but unfortunately scammers are out there. They are really good at making it hard to tell if it's fake or not. Actually, Better Business Bureau receives around 150 reports each year about fake ticket scams. That could be for concerts, for sporting events, everything. And so a big tip is to just avoid buying resale tickets on social media. There's a lot of people who will message you. There's Facebook groups out there but it's not safe unless you personally know the person selling them, but we, we say go with the official websites. I was just about to say around this time of year, I see tons of people on in Facebook groups asking if yeah. anyone has any to sell. So definitely something to be mindful for or mindful of. And with that, where should you look for resale tickets if social media sites aren't the safest? Yes, um, you should look for, you know, official ticketing websites, the well-known companies. CCMF actually does have a ticket exchange system. You can access it right from their website. That's an extra layer of safety. Um, they will control who's buying and selling the tickets. So that's a good idea. Um, if you're looking for that, just make sure that you know the, the fine print. Um, it's, it's very important that you use official websites. Mm -hmm. And now if a consumer thinks that they found actual resale mm -hmm. tickets, what's one thing to look out for before checking out and spending that money? Yes, it's very important, whether you're buying or selling the tickets, mm -hmm. to read the fine print. Um, one thing with CCMF is they have wristbands. So are you gonna be responsible as the seller to get the wristband to the new person who's buying the tickets? Um, that's something to look out for. So most legit websites will, it's better to go with them because they will invalidate validate the original ticket and make a new barcode for you. Mm -hmm. So that can make you feel better. Mm -hmm. Obviously, CCMF is a really fun event. So any other tips for concert goers out there? Yes, when you are at the event, it's very important to download your ticket onto your phone's digital wallet because it's very exciting and there's a lot of people at the venue. So it's a good idea to have that downloaded first instead of trying to go through your email and it won't mm -hmm. load. Um, so that's one tip for you. All right, I'm gonna use that tip myself. <laughs> yeah. Nicole, thanks so much. Thank you. We'll be right back.